Today is the Popo build. Now I'm just gonna start real quick. This build is not so powerful in the attack itself, like speed, attack, and power. It's more all about the kinship attack. So it's kind of like a one-way ticket to big damage, if you know what I mean. Now to start us off, we have Ice Boost XL, of course, and I'll explain, because I usually don't explain the Ice Boost and all those kind of boosts in general. Ice Boost has a 40, I believe, boost to attack, which is pretty nice, so you can do a lot more damage with Ice Elements. But next we have Dancer, and here's why I'm explaining that. Dancer lets you move a bit faster, gives you speed but also it gives you attack and defense. Now, if you don't research a bunch of it, Dancer is actually a very OP gene. It actually gives you 10 more attack boosts than what Ice Boost XL would give you, so you can stack that with Dancer if you're at full HP, giving you 90. And you get a 12 defense boost, so that's pretty nice added there. We then have King Cost Down XL to force lower the kinship cost of everything. We don't have like a lot of heavy moves, but the faster you get to the kinship, then the more fun you'll have. Now here's when it gets crazy, because we're gonna add Kinship Skill Plus Gene XL. Now, we've already answered that Ice Boost XL has a 40 bonus, and then we said that Dancer has a 50. Kinship Skill Plus has a 60 when you use your Kinship Skill. So all that together, you get 150. And then, if we add Ice Clad Gene M, which is Ice Armor, Manya said Ice Armor, not snow armor. Ice armor actually is better if you're wanting attack because that one gives you a ice attack of 30 bonus while snow armor gives you a 15 for both attack and defense just to clear that up. But if you add all that together you'll get about 180 which is pretty powerful if you can stack all that together. And then lastly our attacking stuff is Ice Spear, Vengeful Ice Drill, and Ice Launcher. Ice Launcher and Vengeful Ice Drill can of course do skill seal if you're doing pvp i don't know if it's very effective against normal monsters but you can give it a try we picked ice drill just because in case you are low and you don't have dancer which can happen in some cases you can still do a lot of damage because ice drill depends on how low your hp is is how much power you get and of course we just have ice spear because it's 10 kinship it's not going to cost you anything and if you clash then bam there you go you get kinship pretty quick and that's pretty much it um, I know it seems like a one kind of trick pony build, but it's actually really fun and it's really good against monsters like Cold. Um, would definitely recommend using this if you want to try to speedrun it. Very fun. And again, hope you guys enjoy and have a good day.